So today I'm going to be installing a home link mirror on my base Bronco. The base Bronco does not come with home link. I'm using the garage door remote stuck to the visor. One way to do it is to buy the visor with the home link buttons from Ford. For that to work, I need to have the illuminated visor mirror, which I don't. The base Bronco doesn't come with the illuminated visor mirror. And even with that, I believe uh, the visor with the buttons costs around $300. So I found a cheaper alternative. Toyota sells this accessory home link mirror. It's uh, battery operated and frameless. Looks really good. The mirror is sealed, however, so there's no way to replace the battery if it dies. Hopefully, it lasts a long time. So I'm going to give this a try. The part number for this home link mirror accessory is uh, PT374. 00210. I got this for around $189 Canadian plus tax. In the US is supposed to be around $120. So, to remove the existing mirror, there's a screw at the base of the mirror that needs to be removed, and the mirror should just slide out. I'm using a T20 Torx bit. Once the screw is removed, just hold the mirror stem and pull it upwards, and it slides out. Here's a side-by-side -side comparison of the mirror that came with the base Bronco and the Toyota's accessory mirror. The Toyota's frameless mirror is much bigger and it has home link. So the Toyota's mirror has a similar base. The installation of the Toyota mirror is the exact opposite of the removal of the Ford mirror. Just slide the mirror from the top and tighten the torque screw. No need to over tighten, just snug enough to hold it in place. So the next thing is to program the home link button. I'm going to program the garage door for the middle button. Slow flashing orange light means the button is not programmed yet and is ready to be programmed. So with the orange light flashing slowly, I'm supposed to press the button on the remote for the home link to learn the signal. So now the light on the home link is uh, flashing orange much faster than it was. So now I'm supposed to press the learn button on the garage door opener and press the home link button once to complete the programming. Okay, so I just uh, pressed the learn button on the garage door opener. So I'm going to just press the home link button once. Works. A cheap and simple solution. Hope it helps.